Good morning and welcome to this August 1st version of Sunrise to Sunset with Pastor Gene. In 2004, after five years at Lewisburg, I went, uh, I went to Epworth Church in Durham. And being a city church, uh, you can imagine that the pace was rather hectic. Instead of the parsonage being right beside of the church, the parsonage was about eight miles away. And uh, it, was, it was a bustling center with a preschool and all kinds, of, uh, all kinds of other ministries going on, Interfaith Hospitality Network, where we would house periodically the homeless. Uh, we had a big ecumenical presence uh, in, in the community. Epworth at the time was the largest uh, paying uh, apportionment church in the Durham district. And it was at Epworth that I served on the district uh, committee on ordained ministry as registrar and then later as the chair. And uh, we, had a, we had a connection there with Duke Divinity School and a lot of, uh, a lot of folks would come there and, from Duke and uh, a lot of disciple Bible study, uh, all kinds of things happening practically all the time. An outstanding music program uh, there, and the uh, they had a great bell choir, and of course, um, to this day, one of my um, one of my closest uh, former staff colleagues that I respect so much, Fred Iberson, who was our organist. Um, I used to love the way he would sneak in a little harp the sound as the doxology was about to be played. I'd look at him and kind of grin, and he would too. Um, and we were not talking Charles Wesley either. We're talking about the Tar Heels. So uh, anyway, he 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 did that, he, and he was just so talented. Uh, I had a director of programs there, uh, Robin Marley, who did an outstanding job. She she did the confirmation program, and I just kind of oversaw it. I learned how to delegate things at this church. I had to because it was such a big operation, and people had to do their parts. I learned how to work in a multiple staff situation at Epworth and am grateful to God for that. You know, as we grow, we're supposed to apply the things that we learn and we're supposed to we're supposed to do that. I want you to think about the ways that you've been growing through the years and the ways that you have applied that knowledge and how that has made you a better person, a stronger, a wiser person. And give thanks to God for those things because they are God's gift to us. And they are given to us to use to God's greater glory from sunrise to sunset.